It's no secret that every family has their own approach when it comes to money management. The same can be said for what the children are taught about money. You may be surprised to learn what wealthy parents teach their children about money. Let's get into it. Number 1. Have multiple income streams. It's important that kids understand that they shouldn't rely on one source of income if they want to become financially secure. Encourage them to explore different ways of earning an income and diversify their sources of revenue, so they're not at risk should one stream fail. When you have more than one income stream, you increase your financial security and have something to fall back on. For example, if your current job is your primary income source, you should look for another income source so that you still have some money coming in should you be laid off from your current job. Having multiple income streams also alleviates stress related to your finances. Some examples of different income sources include starting a business, investing in stocks, rental income from rental properties, dividend income, and blogging. Number 2. Invest in yourself. Kids are taught that the most important investment they can make is in themselves through further education or self-development. Show them how this investment has paid off for you long-term and encourage them to do the same. Investing in yourself also boosts your kids' confidence level and teaches them that they are their best assets. Acquiring new skills or expanding their current skill set expands their horizon on their career options and also gives them the security to pursue any job or source of income. Number three, spend wisely. Think before you buy instead of just splurging on things they don't really need. Kids are taught about budgeting and saving for bigger purchases so that they understand why it's essential to spend less than you earn. Teaching kids to become frugal at a young age is important so that your child's attitude toward money is a healthy one. You must remind them that it takes hours of hard work to generate money, and they need to appreciate the value of that money by being smart about how and where they spend it. Number 4. Give Back it's important to have charitable causes or causes to donate time or money toward each year. This is also a great way to show your children the importance of community and to reinforce the idea of helping those less fortunate. Like teaching a child about frugality, you should start teaching kids about generosity at a young age. It teaches them to think about others. Encouraging them to give back to others and their community allows them to see how they can make a difference in others' lives. It is also a smart and effective way to teach them about budgeting and financial literacy. Number 5. Embrace frugality. Being frugal doesn't mean they have to miss out on life experiences or be deprived. It just means finding smart ways to save money so you can have more in the long run. Demonstrate how making small changes like bringing a packed lunch from home, taking public transportation, and using coupons when shopping can make a big difference to their wallet in the long term. One of the most effective ways to teach a child about frugality is to encourage them to save for a big purchase. For example, if they want you to buy a toy for them, teach them to save up a few dollars from their allowance. Over time, when they have saved up enough, they can use that money to buy whatever they want. Delayed gratification will instill the value of patience and money management in a child at a young age. They also better understand the value of money this way since they worked hard for it rather than having it given to them. Number 6. Understand taxes. Stress the need to pay taxes and why it's important for society. Emphasizing the power of tax deductions and legal ways to minimize what you owe each year. Show them how, if they make smart decisions with their money now, they can save themselves a whole lot of trouble in the future. You can vary your approach when teaching kids about taxes depending on their age. They can use this knowledge later on in life when making important financial decisions. Number 7. Take calculated risks. There is no such thing as a sure bet. It's important to show how taking calculated risks can be rewarding in terms of financial gain, but also reinforce that this should always be done carefully in order to reduce losses or potential damage. Children who are taught about taking calculated risks become more resilient as individuals. As they grow older, they are not afraid to take chances, provided that they have invested time to learn about their environment and the situation surrounding that big decision. Number 8. Build a financial plan. Ensure children understand the importance of mapping out goals and creating a financial plan to track their progress toward them. Encourage them to write down their objectives, 
break them down into achievable steps, and set deadlines for each so that they can measure their success. Teaching kids about building a financial plan early sets the foundation for financial literacy later in life. It also promotes a healthy perspective on money among young children. The best way to do this is to start with the basics. Teach them about the habit of saving. Saving teaches your child to set goals and plan how they use money. It also teaches them the value of discipline and preparation for rainy days. Consequently, this habit can increase their independence because they have laid the foundation for financial security in the future. After saving, you can help your child build a financial plan by teaching them how to create opportunities to earn money and to make wise spending decisions. Number 9. Understand the power of compounding interest. The earlier you start investing and saving money, the more time your money will have to compound and grow. It makes sense to start young to take advantage of that time to build interest in your investments. According to financial experts, time is your friend when it comes to investing, and compounding interest is the best proof of that. Number 10. Save for retirement. Reinforce that saving for retirement is essential, no matter what age they are or how much money they're currently earning. It is important to start early and contribute as much as possible to their retirement fund so that they reap the rewards many years down the road. The sooner you begin this conversation with your kids, the sooner they can also act on their retirement plans. This will encourage them to practice money-saving habits as they grow older, such as building an emergency fund, investing their money, and building a retirement fund. They will thank you for starting them young so they can enjoy their retirement benefits. With the right planning, your kids can enjoy a high standard of living when they retire. Wealthy people do not get to that position by chance. Instead, it is because of their healthy attitude toward money, their consistency in staying true to their financial goals, and teaching their kids to do the same. Wealthy people who are smart do not just hand out money to their kids. Instead, they teach them the importance of making, growing, and protecting their wealth. There is no such thing as being too young to get started teaching kids about the value of money. It is important to get started as soon as possible so you can instill the value of money, and they can bring that with them as they grow older. Make sure to provide the support your child needs so they can learn to manage their money appropriately.